What you see in front of you is a wooden Sterling engine. Specifically the RTR model according to um to what this thing says here. One Sterling engine, the RTR model. Pretty much if you've seen these on uh, the internet, then you'd know how it work. Judging with these right here. Pretty much you have some kind of a uh, fuel in here, soaked up by the wick. Then you light the wick on fire. The fire heats up these little tubes here. Um, to build up enough pressure and then you turn this thing and it just starts going now I do want to say this safety first because we are handling some fuel right here so even I have to be very careful so if you do happen to have one of these make sure it's in a safe location keep it away from anything that can easily catch fire now this has a little coating on it that'll prevent um, the base of it from catching on fire. Now, what I'm currently opening right now is an unnecessarily large um, bottle of. 190 proof denatured um, alcohol and stuff. Now, if you can see here, 190 proof. Now, um, pretty much, we're just gonna take these out. We got a little pipette here. Just gonna take some of it. Like I said, be careful. Just gonna put it in there like that. Now we don't need a lot of it. Okay, I did spill it somewhere, so I'm gonna go I'm gonna go ahead and clean up this area, but pretty much put the wick in there. Ooh, and even started sucking it up there. We're just gonna have a look at this one. Now the alcohol's already in there, so... I probably need a little bit more, but... Actually, I think it's still traveling up a little bit. Uh, this other one here is ready. It slowly creeps up the wick. So, it's slowly getting there. Like I said, I'm going to get something to wipe down. Get rid of any uh, alcohol that got on the floor here so be right back right. just gonna put one right there want the bottom of that one yep they're pretty much soaked but still wipe the area off a little bit wipe the pipette as well and also I should have also put this at the beginning. In put do this in a well vented environment because fumes. I'm just gonna say that. <laughs> uh, careful the fumes, just like when you were when I was messing with that Tesla coil earlier. All right, I've moved the alcohol away. It's down the ground there. And pretty much what we're gonna do is like this. Now I'm gonna move it back a little bit. And I've got a fire extinguisher inside if things uh, go south a little bit. Zoom it in a little bit. Alright. Lighter. Lighter. 
some of these are kind of old. Oh, we got one. Two. They're slowly going. If you can see. Slowly go. Alright, and then... Give it a little bit to, um... Uh, to warm up. Because you got to get that warm air going. Oh, kind of. I think they still need to... Uh, Go a little bit. Oh, kind of worked. There we go. Oh. Alright. I blew out the flames. Should start slowing down a little bit. Yep, there's the smoke. Like I said, well vent, well ventilated area. See, there we go. That's cool. Like I said, um, I blew out the wicks, but pretty much let those tubes warm up. And then when it's ready, you gotta spin that thing and it goes. Just wanna... Well, there you go. I hope you uh, enjoyed seeing this in uh, real time, but yeah. Anyways, I'll see you whenever.